Alright everyone, hey this is Charlie from The Gaming Guys and I'm going to bring you a quick world edit tutorial and this is actually going to teach you how to build a giant donut in Minecraft. And yes, you heard that correctly, a giant donut, as in like the kind that you eat. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to do the sphere command and you're going to make a wool um, sphere that's yellow. Yellow wool. Now in order to do like colors and data values, you type in wool and then you do a colon and then yellow. That's how you do them in... in uh, Minecraft world edit, and then five, radius of five, you're going to be stuck inside of it, and it spawns in your center, uh, you have to kind of break out of it, there you go, um, now I'm just going to go ahead and uh, refill the things that I did, that I punched, uh oh, alright, perfect, um, Alright, so now what you're going to do is you're going to bind that to a brush, and you're going to make basically um, a bunch of those. And you're going to be BR Sphere, Wool, um, Yellow, again, and then 5. So there you go. Now what I like to do is, it's kind of a confusing way, but you just kind of have to play around with it. Like this is the center, so that would create one right opposite to it. So to get like a beginning of a curve, I'm going to go one left from the center. Then I'm going to go one more left from the center. Um, this is where I'm clicking, of course. Then one more left of the center. And then one more left of the center. And then last left of the center. See, as you can see, it kind of gets a little curve. And then you just do the same thing on this side. Go here, one left from the center. Go here, one, two, one left of the center. One more left. Uh oh, got punched by that last one. Um, perfect. So now as you can see, I got like half of a donut, kind of, kind of, kind of, sort of. The donut's going to be somewhat ovally, unless you do this. So here, you just do right in the center. Same thing on this side. There's one in the right in the middle. Perfect. And I'll make it so it's not as ovally. And then you're going to do the exact same thing, but on this side. It's kind of a uh, tedious process, but uh, one that you have to do more than this. I might speed up this next section. All right, perfect. That's good enough. Um, you kind of you can't be too picky because it is really hard to get the exact uh, thing. So then you're gonna fly over here, like in one of the corners, and you're gonna type in slash last position one. Fly over. Oh, make sure you're below it too. I was not below it. I don't think so. Slash last position one. Make sure whatever is in between you is nothing. So there's nothing in between you except for the donut. Um, and you're basically manually setting. The position that you would set with the wand. That's what you're doing with this uh, command. And then slash s position two. There you go. And that selects the whole thing. And then overlay. Now the reason you're not doing the grapple is because you don't want it to get on the ground in this part. So it's just easier to do this. So you're gonna slash type in slash slash overlay wool and then let's make a chocolate donut. So let's do brown wool and then that's all you need to type in. There you go. Now you have it covered in brown wool and uh, you got your chocolate donut going on here. Um, and then you can add sprinkles, rainbow sprinkles, if you want chocolate sprinkles. All right, perfect. So here's my donut, uh, all sprinkled and everything. Um, so then what you want to do, that's a very important step in my opinion, is you want to do a BR sphere of air. I'm going to make it of uh, make it three because I know the radius of was five. I'm just going to take a bite out of the donut. Um, hold on, I'll do that. I'm actually going to make this size bigger than that. I'm going to make it. Oopsies. I'm going to make it six. I'm going to take a bite out of this donut. There we go. That's a big bite out of the delicious donut. Um, and then what you want, what you can do if you want, is you can get some. Uh, what color is jelly? Maybe this color. I don't know. But you can get some jelly. Kind of pack some jelly in there. And then, um, 
you know, if you want your donut to be jelly filled. I don't, I don't think chocolate jelly filled donuts exist, though, so that, that might be a problem. Um, but there, um, you can have it leak out too, like in my other one, but um, I'm, I'll just cut to the other one. And so, yeah, this is the a really easy way to make a flying donut in the sky. Um, and then you can, of course, move it to the ground. Um, but yeah, so that's how you do that. Um, it, I didn't even get one day of work, one Minecraft day of work um, to do that. It's really easy, um, and really the, hard, the the longest part is to place the sprinkles. So um, yeah, thanks for watching. I'm actually going to quickly cut to my other donut project. Yes, I have, I have two donut. I have two save files specially reserved for donuts, and here's my other donut, which looks a little more goofy because it has blue frosting in there, the, the jelly's leaking out. But, um, so yeah, they, they're made the same way, um, they're really fun to make, and you can have whatever coloring you want, so, uh, oh, I just launched the same save file as I was on, so, uh, yeah, but thanks for watching, uh, this episode of The Gaming Guys, um, be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. This is definitely one of the more goofy builds that you can do with World Edit, but it's a pretty it's a pretty awesome element to have on your server nonetheless. So um, yeah, thanks for watching. Rate, comment, and subscribe. This has been Charlie. Check out our World Edit playlist for other World Edit videos. All right, and we'll see you later.